Well, welcome back, everybody. On this Wednesday, April the 12th, 2023. Glad you all dropped by today to a Better Me series. Hope all of you all are doing well today. On this blessed day that the Lord has made. Yes, I don't have any birthdays today, so I can spend a little more time with you all. <laughs> Yes. Alrighty then. So we will proceed to our morning prayer, if you will. Dear Lord, thank you for this day of your continuous grace and mercy upon us as we continue to celebrate the sacrifice that you made for our redemption. I truly thank you for who you are and all that you do and still doing in our behalf. Thank you, Lord, for your unconditional love for us. We give you thanks and praise for your blessings and favor as we look to you for our every need. and strength. Lord, I love you. Continue to come to the needs of those who are in need of your blessings on today, Lord. Through the trials and difficult situations, confident and strengthen and keep them in your care, Lord. You are still in the miracle working business. You heal the sick and diseases. You are bringing peace to a troubled mind. And Lord, I ask you if you would bind every evil act that Satan is trying to do to steal, kill, and destroy us. Lord, we thank you for continually making me better day by day. Thank you for your sending your Holy Spirit to abide in us, Lord. All we have to do is receive it. All these blessings I ask in thy son Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Well, I want to thank you all all of you who visit these series, I believe when Jesus is living in us, we are not the same anymore. I believe that it will show in our daily walk the love of God, the love for God. We'll be illuminated and draw others to Him. To me, that's empowerment. Okay, our topic for today is real talk. And we're talking about, is it working? Are you getting better day by day? Our scripture coming from Romans 7 chapter, 18 through 19 verses, and it reads... For I know that in me, that is, in my flesh, dwelleth no good thing. For to will is present with me, but how to perform that which is good I find not. For the good that I would do, for the good that I would, I do not. But the evil which I would not, that I do. Well, it's because good in itself does not dwell in in me or you in our sin, sinful nature. Although I have the desire to do good, I keep doing wrong. Anybody else feel like that? So that tells me 
what I'm trying to do on my own ain't working. Why? Because we are all born in sin. Do we have to remain this way? No. Not if you plan to meet the king. Listen. We know we ain't right. But to do nothing and don't try to seek and find out how it is possible to do right is ludicrous. If God didn't think it was possible, he would not have made it a requirement. We have a ram in the bush. We have the Lamb of God, Jesus, who was sacrificed for us. Seriously, though, desire to do right live like God wants you to, to live the time is at hand for a renewed mindset where you will be able to be what God wants you to be and that is to love him and to love one another as you do yourself all I have for you today. God bless you. I love you. And until next time, if God allows, is it working?